Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to Ostrov, where we're just about to get our farm built. Let me speed this up again, and I think we're bringing our last couple of thatch over. Yep, one, two. And you're going to drop off the cart, then you're no longer there. We should get a worker. That's going to trigger here soon. We'll get the last two layers of roof in, and we've got a farm. And just a moment ago, the clay pit went in. After all the construction is done. Of course. But that means we got lots of logs. Well, okay, the logs have been processed as fast as it went in. No, there's four logs. So that does count as a log. It's kind of buried in the ground, though. Hmm. Yeah, so we need some kind of an auto-leveling area when we put the, the buildings in, huh? Oh, well. it It's interesting. Uh, did we... There we are. Not nope, waiting for a worker. But no more slot for labor is available because all the materials have been brought. Okay. So, for we speed two, and I see that they have jumped over and started working on the fishing dock instead of the boat yard next. Because removing one tree is in. Oh, okay. We haven't been able to do that because we were removing these trees. I see. So, I'm making it difficult on them. Mm -hmm. That was a farm, wasn't it? Aha. Perfect. So we've got the farm in. Where are we? June or January? We've got till the 1st of March. Okay. So I don't need to slow it down. Let's add fields and let's think about this. I want... Oh, they've been bringing over materials. So the place is right over here where they've been dropping the materials off. So these pathways are going to modify and go away and, and actually track into here now. Though I do see they're leaving two different places to get there. Okay. Um, then let's force a pathway into here. So something like there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I wonder what is... Two. Okay, well, there's the answer. That is too long. All right, so if we went there and took you out to took you out to 20 over here let's think about that did another one over there and that'll leave a corner right here let's see could I have hit the shift I probably could have but if we do another one like so track you out like that that looks fairly parallel take you out to 20 like that do we do one bigger I'm looking at this distance right here. If we hit 25, that looks fairly even. I'm going to hold the shift down. Nope, doesn't let me build another field. Okay, so there's two. That distance looks pretty good. We look almost parallel. Yeah, I'm off a little bit, but that'll be fine. Um, I don't know that they really had survey teams back then, so maybe, maybe it's fairly realistic. Another field smaller I'm thinking and we went out something like so thinking this pathway here the same pathway right there and take you out to a good 15 like that that will leave us an area that would naturally look like it needs something and I'm thinking that something is the cow shed and a well some more houses and some hay Okay, I'm liking that. Another field. <clears throat> Something like so. And again, the first side you pull is the one that gets the uh, that gets the opening. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I see it just it changes like that. There's no way to really know where that is. So we're just gonna have to get close. So there. As we pull it out, you see the opening. But you can also hit R or at least R. T? Yep, R and T. We'll swing that opening around if you wanted to change that. But something like this. And 15 there as well. We could. I think so. So a couple of smaller ones. And then maybe a couple of bigger ones back over here. Now, I'm thinking windmill. Well, we've got this area and we've got this area. So that does kind of work. So what if we instead made some longer farms that weren't as far out? 
Yeah. Now, too bad I can't force an opening through so they can walk to these fields. They still have to go all the way around to get to them. But that means we definitely want the openings on this side. Is there any reason to put the openings right on the end, though? That could work, too, because it's going to be a long but narrow field. Let's think about that. Um, is there a better way to see this? Where's the town? Oh, that's interesting. So it's kind of right there. Boy, how did that get so far off? Really interesting. If I get over here, I could have swore. So it's almost like the lines that we followed when it was green are not straight. Is there any way to know? I'm looking at the little one right here. You can kind of see where we're aimed. Due north looks about like that. Right where I would think. So, so much for the idea that I made a straight line in there. Oh well. The distance. We'll blame it on perspective. Yeah, that's that's it. Alright, so I want this gap right there. There. You. So something like... No. No. We can touch these. Huh, I can't do that one. Okay, find that corner. It does snap to it. If we head out to something like this and take you on out to about there. That works pretty good. And then rotate that pathway around to there. I think that does a pretty good job. It's not perfectly even with the other one. But it nah, doesn't really have to be. Somewhere in there. Let's see if we can pull that off again. That worked a lot better than I thought it would. Okay, I need you to snap. I think you snapped. No, you didn't. And something... Hmm. What was that noise? That was the fish, right? I gotta get in here a little closer. I gotta stop talking. Are you gonna snap in? I think it's right there. It is right there. All right. <clears throat> To get you even, we're going to have a much bigger field. Do we do that? All right, you're the you're the exception. You're the biggest field of all. All right. So there's the layout, and from there, we're going to do cattle in one area. We're going to do uh, windmill and that kind of production in another area, and probably housing. Yeah, I like that. Okay, with that, what do we have over here? You did get done. We don't need to employ you yet, though I will order three boats. You're next. I'm running at speed two. Yep. And we're getting close to being done. In fact, there's no more slots for laborers, so I'm assuming that means that all of the, uh, uh, the supplies have been brought. In fact, we can watch it finish right here. And after that... We're going to slow down because we've got to figure out what is next. So the carpentry is next. Let's take you down to speed one. All right. Are we liking this so far? I think so. The windmill is critical soon, but it doesn't have to be just yet because we've got to go through an entire season before it's going to be used. It won't be used until next winter. So that was next on my list, but instead, I guess let's jump out to the cow shed. I think so. Cow shed, we could trigger it to use any fallow field. There may, by coincidence, be at some point a season with no fallow fields. So you can't depend on that. Um, cow shed, you were right up there. You are this size. You kind of fit in there. Uneven terrain. And your doors are that way. Let's spin you like so. So the entrance is pretty much near the town. Hmm. Get up here. There we go. Does it make sense as to where? Can it be at this end? Is there any conflict with that? Any reason why not? We need to get hay over here. We need to get water over here. 
which would make sense if it was all in this area. And it wouldn't hurt to put a house or two over here too. Question is, too bad I can't set a house to not fill. Just build it and have it set. But the instant it builds, the game basically rents it to a family right then and there. They haven't arrived yet. They arrive sometime later, but they are now the proud owners of it. So I can't just, well, I, I could lay out footprints. I'm just worried about filling up the queue too much with a bunch of paused buildings. That was a problem before. Maybe it no longer is, but I don't know that. You're there. You're the carpentry. That one we can employ soon. Ah, there is something else we can do, though. Let's think about carts. And now that I think about it, I probably should have put a cart right in there. Yes, I should have. And while we're running at speed one, let's do that. Let's get rid of you. Demolish, demolish, and the cow shed, demolish. All right, let's get carts in and those sort of services in first. Uh, transportation, cart parking, front door, right there, parallel, right there, hmm, and we can't get in there because of our yellow or orange field of doom. If we were to do this, would that look better? I think so, though they would need to be able to walk around it to get into here. So no matter what, we need to leave a pathway, which means this would work just fine. Yeah. Okay. You're going to go there. Although, if that could be straight out, they would head toward it. Yeah. You demolish. I'm glad that's free. Let's put you instead. You're not what I want. Uh, right there, that one. We're straight out from this pathway. What do we think about that? They're most likely going to go to it to grab what they need to take it back. Hmm. They need a pathway from here to go behind and get into all of these, so it could be out at a place like this. Just fine. Okay, I like that. So that's going to go there. In that case, the fields do what? And can we do this a little smarter this time? And come out from a corner somewhere right in this, this line right here and build a field this way? Or do we build two fields out this way? And give more room for the cattle and the well and lots of hay and things like that? As well as the windmill. Now, that's an idea. All right, so... I want, hmm, okay, demolish you. This is a work in progress. I, I, I don't have a, you know, this is the jigsaw puzzle with the, the cover on the box is missing. I just have a bunch of parts. I don't know what it's supposed to look like. Let's field this half and leave this pathway open all the way into here, which means I now want cart parking on this side. I want the field on that side. So where is that point? straight in so right there kind of right in that area right there isn't it here's an auto save let's try uh field and what is our distance out it can be fairly close now because we're gonna do everything out in here interesting all right, you now, now will you snap? You will. Let me take you to that corner and head this way, but go out further, as far as a pathway, about like this. What distance are you? You're, a tw you're almost a 20, okay. So delete that back and snap. There really is not a snap. Oh, because I'm not going down the length of another one. Okay, so I'm just gonna have to experiment here. So if you were to go something like this, all right, so you gotta go in just a touch. So right click right there. That followed close enough. It's a double fence right over there, but I'll live with it. So you're gonna go there, you're a 20. 
I could then put another field out over here. It snaps and right there. Okay, so where to? Skinny and long? Let's see. Hmm. Yeah, that kind of defeats the plan that I had. I could go past now. Something like this. But I can't get two fields over here. Okay. Well, I guess we're just going to live with that. Rotate you to there. Now we've got five fields that pretty much form a square. What is the next plan then? Just pop a little something right there. Just work with five fields for now. We'll just do that. Yeah, five fields and all the support. Actually, it looks pretty good, doesn't it? I like that. We could then do another farm cluster out over here. I like the look of that. That looks quite professional. Like, like it was done on purpose. Ooh. Okay, so we need carts over here now. And we need to coax them to go straight. So, f carts right in this area. Yeah. Carts right there. So, we're working on the carpentry, and we're in February. Let's kick the speed up. Well, now let's, let's not, because I've still got to plan out what's going to go in the fields. All right, so we don't, speed is not an issue right now. Right now, I just need to, to uh, get it all figured out before they're standing around saying, um, boss, um, what, what, what we need to do. All right, you're there, coming out of town. That works pretty good. So, third cart. No, there's going to be no transporting in here for a whole season. All right, so we'll let the carpentry build that one. But speaking of, I need another building laid out they can be working on while we're working on this. What is that going to be? Um, windmill, cow shed, cow shed. There it is. Okay. Cow shed does what? There's the possibility that there could be a path going out this way. That is possible. I'm trying to decide if the cow shed is going to butt up against the fence. Or is going to be a path behind it? Does it go here? Well, uneven terrain. Answered that question. Okay, doesn't go there. Um, he can go right here, though. But boy, yeah, we do lose part of the building. That really rolls in here, doesn't it? Okay. Um, I don't want to put it necessarily close to this. This needs to be close to water and hay. The windmill needs to be close to this. I guess let's lay out the windmill. I mean, he kind of just does this, but does he do it right in the pathway? Let's come out over here. I mean, does does he sit right there? There's probably no reason why not, except they're going to stumble on that little pokey thing sticking out there, the big handle, the big popsicle stick, as they try to get into the farm. So it's going to look funny, enough to where it really needs to be right over here, doesn't it? It could be like that. That looks pretty good. After that side there. Yeah, I think so. He goes right there. So that's the one milk. They can start working on that. Cow shed. And then trading is probably the next major building. And then we've got to think about getting some more houses in. But I didn't want to put them in yet, even though it'd be nice to, to have them there because I was afraid that people were going to start moving in. And that's right, they can't move in until there's food. But even then, as soon as there is food, they're going to move in. And we're not going to be ready to handle it. We're going to have people starving. So let's get lots of jobs available. Then make sure there's a good production of food available, which means we need to choose what's going to happen February, March 1st. Okay, let's get to work on this. I want you to be, I want you to be employed. Let's put in a manager. And, boy, Svitania? Sv yeah, um, I think there's an L in there. My monitor's too far away. Oh, lots of little other little marks in there. Okay, yeah, you're employed there. I'll never get used to these names. They're not names that I, that I see every day. You're going to be there so that we can have a little bit more control here. 
Oh, and we've got the progress bar in. That's right. That's part of patch three. So we can see how, how it's going. Anyway, I want probably two crops of wheat. Two crops of potato. Ha. Huh. How about the biggest crop of wheat? Let's do that. Yeah, you're going to be wheat. Activate. You're number one. You're furthest away, so get you started first. Does that sound logical? You are not going to... That's right, it doesn't show you what size they are anymore. Hmm. It would be nice if that was indicated here. Field 25 parentheses, and field 29 parentheses, and 15, 15, and 20, or something like that. But you can be wheat... You need to be potatoes. Not what I wanted. You potatoes and activate. Active, active, okay. I do want to get a little of all of them in. So you can be sunflower. And this bigger one could be hemp. Now what do we want to double up on? I'm thinking it's the potato because we'll be trading with that to get our cow. So let's look at it this way. We've got two potatoes, a wheat, a sunflower, and a hemp. All right, that looks good. All the fields are 100%, though after we're done, for instance, the sunflower is going to, I haven't activated, okay, is going to lose all of its red, 40% of its green, and it's gonna lose 30% of its blue. So we're gonna have 70% of blue left the hemp qualifies to go in there, although there's no red. Huh. So you got to think about what's left over. And it's not, I don't think it's necessarily exactly these numbers. It depends on how much of the growth bar actually made it across as to how much of those nutrients really got, uh, got used up. But it's not just a matter of randomly putting other crops in so they're different every time and rotating. It's rotating based upon which crop qualifies with whatever is left over in the field when you're done. So you got to think about that. It's a big jigsaw puzzle. Speaking of jigsaw puzzle, that's quite the impressive uh, melt going on there, isn't it? Anyway, we have... We're wanting sunflower in there. Okay. And activate. Activate. And activate. All right. So that is ready for workers. Well, we're ready for laborers. Do we want to limit the laborers? I don't think so. I think... I'm already really pushing it to get five fields in. I wasn't going to do all five. But last time we didn't get started with the farm until, you know, middle of April. So we're starting March 1st. You know, boom, we're going to see this fill up. So I think we're going to be fine. Don't have a lot of critical building uh, projects that are necessary either. So it'll be a good time just to kind of catch up on the nails, which are... Not there, he's still working. Uh, logs, we've got 12 logs in. In fact, we're done here. We can take one guy out of here, let's let the other guy maintain, because there's not much more wood going in. The carpentry, let's give him something to do. And he's going to pull, yeah, I'll put you back in there, because he is going to pull uh, all kinds of, of lumber out of there. Let's fill these guys up. You, although if I did it in order, can I cancel? I can. One there, and one over here. And then two over here. Now, can I stack... How many orders can I stack in? Four orders in queue. And then if I did another one. And then another one. And another one. Do you have eight? Seven. Yeah, something like that. Seven. Okay. So that gives him something to do. And these guys something to maintain. All right, we're good there. Windmill's going to be worked on by whatever laborers aren't working here as they start to fill up. The women are doing that. Good. It gives everybody a job for the most part, and which means every house has got an income for the most part. So a good balance there. Cow shed still needs to be thought about. And you know, it would have been easier before the... Uh, is that my... <laughs> I can't see my circle. That's the base of the windmill. It'd be easier to lay out that cow shed when it was snowing. I can kind of see the squares better. 
All right, cow shed. There, up here. And now we know that the cows do not necessarily walk out these ramps and go into a field. So it doesn't really matter where this lays out. Hmm. In fact, we could even rotate it. We can put the back of it into here. Kind of like that idea. Let's spin you around. That puts the people door. Now it still puts the people door. Not too close to the people. Hmm. Well, can I use you to kind of border this walkway? That might work, though it's so uneven we're going to keep losing our ramps. Hmm. Walkway. Get out over here a little bit. So that puts you kind of like so. Somewhere in there. Right there would probably look good from this angle. What is that like over here? So that's something like that. Too uneven. That's interesting. It seemed to work when I was down over there. I guess it was more like here. But I'm just noticing... Well, it's hard to get a good angle to work at. But still, we don't have... Yeah, our, our, everything's buried into the ground. Okay. I want the cows in this area, but I'm probably not going to be able to put it where it looks good because of the unevenness of the ground. In fact, Frodo's probably just going to have to pick a spot and say thank you. All right. Something like that. Let's at least get it parallel. That's pretty close. Right there. So somewhere over in here that has a staircase and two ramps showing. Where is that? Something like that. Getting better right there. Right there. That's where it goes. Okay, we'll work around that. And last little bits would be hay and wells. Okay, we only have two projects going, so I would say it's probably good to go ahead and put all those in. Can I straighten this fence up a little bit? Because I want to put a well right there. Let's see if we can do a little better job at this. You... I cannot select you. There you are. Demolish you. Alright, let's try this one more time. Get you in the center of the screen, aiming pretty north or straight up. There. That was this fence. So what looks right? I'm thinking there. What do you think? I went a little beyond, didn't I? Yep. I'm nitpicking. I want to hit the delete button. That didn't work. Demolish. One more time. It's hard to get you know, into the position to see all the different angles. Somewhere in there. So we're going to come just shy. The shadows also throw you off, too. Can't tell what's a shadow and what's a fence. Alright, whatever that is, it is. That works. Okay, with that there, let's set a well. Oh, this is not the so much the critical one. These guys are all pretty much equidistant. I'm thinking of getting rid of this one and kind of getting it in different centers. I don't know, what do you think about that? Should everything be centered here in the same distance of walking, or should we get a well here and a well there? Actually, a well to the center of each one. Well, then it's, these guys are just as far away from it. Hmm. Well, we know we're going to need one over here. We're not necessarily going to have cattle this year. We're still going to get the trading post in and all that. So that one's not going to... doesn't have to be built first. I was thinking a well would look good in this area. Probably there, or should it be at the end? Should it be like here? These three houses would feed it. If I spin you around, will you go up in here? You will. What if we did that? There. I think so. You're going to go there. Kind of wanted another one out over here. Now yeah, we'll go with that for now. So we won't add too much to the queue. Otherwise, what? When all these build, I'm thinking next year is when we're going to want to start seeing more houses in. In one full year of production going on, 
and let's turn the speed up so we can you guys can watch the uh, you know I didn't order them oh I didn't um, you can change the order of when they work on things and we got sunflowers in first hmm. the sunflowers are the least important they're mostly just to see how things work you're down there hemp is next important but potato actually that's well they're both food okay potato wheat potato and then hemp and sunflower now right, there's the, the order that they're going to do things and a whole bunch of them just left huh they just left we need to get some benches out here All right there you and there's going to be potentially quite a few workers here so rotate you around let's put a few benches in this area something like you're gonna you're gonna insist to run around there or run behind it let's go over here instead now let's go over here all right i like that and shift you're there another one i guess back in there And just because it's been our pattern, let's put one at the cart. There. Okay. So we've got carts out here. We've got benches out here. We're going to need water out here. Lay that out next time? Or will I forget next time? All right, let's just pop it in right now. Water. More houses are probably in here. Probably. Although the clay is over here, it'd be nice to actually make some use of it, huh? <laughs> um, I think that probably works. Yeah, we'll do that. Let's throw some hay out here. Hay dryers. And hold that shift button down. Get a sense of where. There. But not here. I want to actually. Actually, let's just move over to this. What was that last one? Oh, wait a minute. Stop. Pause. I just looked up and realized something. We never employed these. We never employed them. All right, two people get to work there. We got to get that going. We need fish coming in. Yep, I blew that one. Well, only blew it by three weeks because I was running at one speed for for quite a while. Okay. That other noise, what was that? This is it. Okay, that was it. And that doesn't need to. I thought maybe I'd put two of these in. That just set a whole chain of, uh, of events going off in my brain. And it landed right there. <laughs> I won't explain it. Um, hey, that's where I was. Hey, I want to put this guy here so the hay storage is close to the front door and the water is close to the front door so like so the front is actually right on the top side there so hold the shift down let's put two of you in there and there now more hay dryers and I can't get two circles in here can I now so close as I can get is right there. Gotcha. Over here. There, and one more. All right. Plenty to do for our laborers. Speaking of, only two are active right now. I'm at speed two. I'm not. Let's see this happen. Now we got benches to sit at so they can take a break over here if in fact it is a thing I've never actually verified that but three are employed just realize something different color dress do we have oh she's the manager I'll bet she is Lada and nope that was Svetlana oh I can see it now I'm I'm trying to stay this side of my microphone, but the, the monitor is about you know, two and a half feet in front of me. I've got a, almost a three foot deep desk and I've got the monitor up on the wall. So when they get that tiny, it gets a little hard to see. So, but I was just noticing the different dresses. I had not seen that before. Have you? 
I mean, there's a winter, there's winter clothes, but I've never seen, in fact, it's a black top and a red dress. And a white, there's actually multiple dresses now. Are there multiple shirts for the guys? Let's get out of our drone view here and get down a little bit lower. Where is a guy? There? No. <laughs> Just have the one right now. Okay. And you. Same. And where are the guys out here in the uh, in the woods? They're not in the woods right now. Uh, boats? We got over here. Anybody employed here? Nobody's employed here. Ouch. Why is that? How do I get somebody employed there? Nobody's employed in the carpentry. And one smithy. That's worrisome. What's going on? Oh, I never turned on the carpentry. I see. That's me. I thought I was clicking on this. The forestry. Okay. Let's... We have wood for a while. Let's get the boats going. We have reeds and thatch. Let's get you going. Yeah, we're definitely going to need more houses, but we can't afford the houses until we've got the food to, to feed everybody. So it's going to be hit and miss for a couple of years until we kind of get ahead of the curve here. Right now, the most important thing is happening right here. So if I were to... Are all these women? I'm thinking those are all female names. They are. So no guys are out here laboring. So where are all the guys? Cows? There's one laborer. Well, there's one worker there now who should be grabbing a cart. We've got one worker there. Okay. It's working. Kind of. Hmm. Okay. Well, I think I'm at my time limit here. I'm going to call this one done. We've got a we've got a mess to work out next time. So it's been Noble Rambler. Thanks, guys, for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.